Hi, happy Monday. It is a long weekend here in Canada. It's family day. And so I've got the day off. I'm here actually at the mall. I haven't been here in a while. Like we came here last week to go to a movie for Valentine's Day, but I haven't like made a return in a long time because I think I've been doing better with my shopping. I guess I got a coat two weeks ago, maybe. But anyway, the point is, I just haven't been here in a while to do a return. Um, the mall's only open till six today and it's four, um, which is fine, but I think I'd like to wander around a little bit to get a bit of a walk-in. So I'm gonna return a couple things and then I have like two pairs of pants to return. And then I got a shirt at Uniqlo, this like Snoopy t-shirt, and I think it's really cute and I love it. And I wanna just see if I can exchange it for a size up. And then I might get some Nespresso pods. I've been trying not to buy them leading up to my trip because I want to budget more, but like the instant coffee is so terrible. So I might just go buy a few. That's some sort of lip situation. I like this Sephora one. It's kind of like plumping, but I find using the plumping ones sometimes helps me with like keeping my lips from getting chapped. Uh, that could be in my head. I've told myself it's because it makes the blood go there. <laughs> so it's like helping the skin, I don't know. A little moisturizer, Glossier, we love. I'm also listening to that Glossier glossy book. I'm doing it in an audiobook, And I feel like the person who wrote it just hates like Emily Weiss, like the founder of Glossier. Maybe that's like the point of the book, I don't know. But she just like has so many little snarky comments in there. And I can't tell if it's because it's the audiobook or like if I'm just like hearing the narrator say it that way, it seems pretty snarky. I think this is the start of a new vlog. If you are new here, I'm Morgan. Um, today, like I said, it's a holiday. I got up, we both slept in, Ben and I got up. We ended up making pancakes. I made chocolate chip ones. He just made normal um, and they were really good. I've been, I never buy milk. So for all of our baking lately, we've been using sour cream instead. And we tried with the pancakes doing like half water, half sour cream for the milk portion. And I do feel like it tastes really good. They didn't like get as cooked even when we'd cooked them for a long time though. Like they stayed more like moist, I guess. Um, but yeah, I felt like they were good. So pretty out, perfect. Turns done. I'm just peeking around the bay. Okay, so I found a couple things. I'll show you. Okay, um, I had a little too much fun at the mall. I went to do my return, so I returned some stuff, got back like just over 100 bucks, and then exchanged that t-shirt because I still wanted it, so I just swapped for a medium. Hopefully that fits. The small was just kind of tight on my chest, so as long as it's a little bit bigger, we should be good. Then I looked at Banana Republic and the Bay, and I grabbed a couple things. When I was going through my pants, and as I've been going through my closet, something that I wanted was a pair of pants that's like... I noticed I had tried many times to buy pants that were like khaki, is that what it's called? Like camel khaki, you know, the yellowy color. And they just look so bad on me, but I still wanted something that wasn't quite white. Um, and I've been watching one of my favorite vloggers and she recently posted with some pants that were this kind of like gray, taupey, I don't know the word for it, like a light khaki, I guess. Anyway, um, so when I was at the bay, I found some and they were on sale. These ones were actually not the cheapest. I think these ones were on sale for 50. They're this kind of color. So it's pretty light, like a light tan. White, I don't know my colors, I guess, right now. Um, and they're lovely. They're along. They're part of the sale section. They're from Cotton On and uh, just no frills. 
they're really nice. These actually fit me. I was originally, I tried these on in a smaller size and I was actually going to grab them. I had them in my like to buy pile. And then I had found these at like the last second. I was like, oh, I should try like the size up. And I liked how these fit in my legs better. There's like a little bit of like extra fabric maybe in the crotch area, but it looks better. The other ones looked pretty tight in my thighs. And like, that's another thing I was looking at as I was doing my pant try on is that I don't love when the pants are super tight in my thighs, but sometimes like I would look at ones that are less tight and they would look too sloppy. Anyway, I just really like these. The color will work with absolutely everything and they were a great price. So I'm really happy about those. That was like something I have been thinking about all week. Like, oh, it'd be kind of cool to have pants like that. And then there they are and they're on sale and it was easy. Um, someone's about to get in their car in front of me, so I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Someone got in their car right in front of me, so I'm not about to keep filming. Um, as I've been going through my tops, there has been a couple holes, one of them being tops that fit me. Um, I bought a lot of really baggy, oversized, or just like t-shirts, and I feel like every single day I go through my closet and I'm like, why don't I own a single shirt that's not like, like a baggy cotton shirt? Anyway, um, so this was a risk because it's like smaller than I would normally buy, especially at this point. It was 20 bucks on sale. It's a little button up with frills and a little frilly arm. And it looks really cute. Um, so I really like that. That's just like a little more fitted than I normally would buy and I've been buying lately. And it also has a little more interest to it because sometimes I'm like bored of just like kind of the plain on plain. So I like the little frills, the little ruffles. I like that it's quite fitted, but then it still has a little like space in the back for me to move. Um, so I'm really happy with that for 20 bucks, great. Um, these are just a pair of jeans. Again, as I was going through, I didn't really have a straight leg pair except for the Levi's that I really like could still fit. Um, and those are still a little tighter maybe than I want. Anyway, I just tried these on. They're long, they've got like a, um, what's it called? Like a trimmed hem bottom, unhemmed bottom, I don't know. Clearly I need to like go to fashion school and like learn some language. Anyway, these are from Only. They're the Emily Straight High Waisted Crop. I'd say they're like really long on me. They went to my ankles, so I don't really know how cropped they would be. Maybe they're a long. Not that I can see. Um, and these were 40, but then when I went up, they were actually 30. So that is everything from the Bay. And I'm actually really excited about all those pieces. I know I'm gonna wear them all this week. Um, and I want to wear that little blue top, I think, with like the light pants because I just think it's a really cute vibe. And then you saw the, I don't know if I showed you the Snoopy shirt, maybe I'll show you. At Banana Republic, I got one thing. It was $40, um, originally $120. And it is also like another um, top that is a style that's like been bigger. It's like one of these kind of tops, just normal. I should have unfolded it all. Um, but I really like the pattern on it. I own a couple shirts like this and I don't really wear them. The reason I don't really wear them is they're so oversized and I just feel like they look really sloppy and I don't reach for them. I love this print. I also think this would be cute with those light pants. Um, and I'd love to wear more prints. I feel like I've gotten lazy as well with just wearing like plain colors. So I often find myself looking in my closet for a print and I have like three probably Aritzia shirts kind of like this and they're just so oversized that when I put them on, I'm like, it's just not the look. So this I also bought in a smaller size than I usually would um, because even though it is like an oversized fit, it ended up being a little more like structured in through like the sides. And so I still have the oversized look in like the width kind of like with the back. Um, but it actually like fit a little better. The length like isn't too crazy either. So I could wear it like not tucked in. And I'm just really excited about all those pieces. I think I would genuinely bring all these things with me on my trip because I think these will all like look really cute where I'm going. Um, and I'm just happy about those. And then I'll show you my little t-shirt. This is just silly. I got this on Valentine's Day when we were going to a movie and I just was like, oh, it looks like a nice t-shirt. It's just this, it says, it's like a cropped kind of one. Well, it's not cropped, I think it's like waist length. Uh, it says Peanuts Cool Down Club. And I just really like the color. 
that's me. I'm gonna head home now. I don't know what else we're gonna do today. I think we were we were going to make pasta, but then I was like, no, we should make something else because we had pasta a few nights ago. And I think we have some like marinated chicken breasts that we bought at Safeway or co-op or something like that in the fridge, maybe co-op. So I think we're gonna make those with some broccoli and then we might put cheese whiz on the broccoli. If you do that, you know. <laughs> it's like the childhood thing that I can never let go of and neither can Ben. And uh, yeah, I think I'll just go home. I saw my client has messaged me about some podcast episodes that I've been waiting to get approval on. So those are ready for me to schedule now. So I'll do that and then probably clean, chill, get ready for the work day to start tomorrow. I did run into my coworker Lydia in the mall, which was nice. So I think we are both gonna go to the office tomorrow. So I'll see her. And I think I'll probably add tomorrow to this vlog as well. I was gonna maybe do a daily, but let's do a two day. I'm trying to get as close to like a daily upload right now as I can, um, just because I feel like it's like more fun. We chat more. I know more of you comment because it feels like you're like more caught up. And I don't know, it's just like so fun to vlog. So I'll probably, add tomorrow to this one and then carry on from there oh i also didn't get an espresso pods because i bought clothes so i'm sticking with the instant hello it is tuesday it's always weird starting the work week on a tuesday after the long weekend um i don't think much happened from when we left off ben and i started watching love is blind last night we thought we were caught up but we're actually only on season five so we're like two seasons behind right now or one season behind so i'm getting used to having to wash my hair more often and i didn't today i think it's still okay when i was blonde it like makes your hair drier or like more porous or something so like it really absorbs the oil and i could get away with washing my hair like maybe once or twice a week and now i have to do it every second day so it goes but anyway i'm here i'm wearing the shirt that i bought yesterday i gave a quick wash last night um the new pants i ended up wearing a black coat i tried it with like a brown coat but i thought that looked really weird with the pant color um and then i just have on i've been wearing the same black boots for a while because they're ones i can kind of like trudge around in the snow but i'm so excited to be able to wear other like shoes and i would love to wear this like this with the pants or even a different pair of pants with more of like a little pointy heel or something um i ordered a pair of black little heels that are on the way so we'll see if those fit but i have a cute little pair i thrifted that are these red um little like slip-on super pointy heels they almost have a little bit of like a cowboy print to them if i'm picturing them right and i would love to wear those but it's not time yet so in the spring we'll get into the heel vibes but it's still disgusting out so i don't want to ruin my shoes today is actually looking like it's going to be not like chill but like chill meetings wise i only have one meeting my other meetings all got canceled um so it's really going to be more focusing on a strategy I'm trying to remember what I'm even working on. A strategy and like some emails probably. And then getting ready for podcast stuff. So should be pretty good. I think it should be good. Um, yeah, let's just get in there. Don't really have too much to catch up on. Do you see this ground? Like you can't wear a cute shoe on this. It does feel really warm though. Like I feel very overdressed right now. I have a check for the temperature. Spring, is spring coming? time. Lydia? <laughs> <laughs> Not again. <laughs> Not never again. <laughs> it is the end of the day. I have an appointment tonight. And then after my appointment, I have therapy. 7.30 at night. I wonder how that's gonna go. I don't have anything to talk about except that I don't want to be doing a call at 7.30 at night. Anyway, the rest of the day went good, got lots done, and I'm excited to get home for my appointment. Well, I guess I'm not that excited because I just have a call, but tomorrow I have an appointment a little earlier in the day, so the evening will be free. I'm excited for that. I'm done with my appointment, and the fact that I'm carrying around in my bag 
makes me really happy. Um, I'm gonna head home now. I have my call, like I mentioned, in about an hour or an hour and a half. I'm not sure exactly what time it is. And then we also wanna make dinner. I'm not totally sure what we're doing. Um, so it's gonna be a little bit of a weird end to the night. And yeah, so thank you for being here for this vlog. Um, and for those of you who joined because of my closet cleanout series, I hope that that is something that's enjoyable to watch. Um, I do know I have a lot of shit, and that's why I'm doing it. And I hope it's like an enjoyable thing to watch. I know I really like to watch like content like that where people are just kind of doing something I can put in the background. There's not much plot to it. Um, so hopefully it feels like that for some of you. And it's been cool having some more of you reach out in the comments. So please feel free to keep commenting on those videos or comment here to say hi. I'd love to chat with you hear what you're all about let me know um otherwise i will probably start a new vlog in a couple days i think tomorrow i'm going to film the purses portion of the closet clean out um depending on how old my timing goes with the day and work and how the light is in the evening and then i'll probably pick up vlogging again on thursday and friday so yeah that's the deal i might have something to say tomorrow who knows but i'll be back very soon i hope you enjoyed this one thanks for being here please hit subscribe if you haven't and i will see you again very soon bye